Hey guys, what is up? Dave here coming back to you with a brand new video on the channel and today's video is another ad block detection video. I know some of my OG subs here might be sick of these videos, but I had somebody respond to one of my posts on Reddit with a link to this tamper monkey script or grease monkey, depending on which web browser you use. And I looked it over, and despite what I said in my first video that has almost 75,000 views at this point, this script covers all the bases. This is a great script, and I wanted to go through, I looked over the whole thing, it's, there's nothing funky in it, it's all good, like this is probably, without going through and installing an Android emulator and all that, this is the best way to block the ad detection on YouTube, hands down. No joke. So, how do you install it? Well, I'm going to show you guys Chrome first because uBlock on Chrome definitely doesn't work anymore. So, I installed Chrome basically only for this video. <laughs> I don't use Chrome. Um, ooh, there are things on this screen that could get me in trouble. Um, I've used it for a few other things. I don't even know how to get extensions on Chrome. Okay, manage extensions. Chrome Web Store. We are learning this together. Grease Monkey. It's not here. Is it Tamper Monkey? Tamper Monkey? Okay, it is Tamper Monkey. Uh, okay. Anyway, so we're going to install Tamper Monkey. Add. Trust me, we're learning together. Now Tamper Monkey is installed. So what we need is we need that link for GitHub. Da, 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 da. As you can see, Tamper Monkey was installed. Now we need to go to the bug fixes. You want to go to releases. And you can either download the script like I'm about to do, or it'll open up in the extension like this instead. I forgot about that. And you just click install. That's it. No joke. That's it. Then you go to YouTube. Can't even spell YouTube. I don't even have a Google account logged in on this uh, page. Wow, this is what you see if you don't have a YouTube account? This is gross. Can't hit my kid? Of course not. Uh, so, we're not going to get an ad. See? No ad. And you could see it did like the little yellow bar thing, like it was going to play an ad. It didn't do an ad. Now, you should still have an ad blocker installed with this, because this is just like for detecting the ad block uh, being used. So you, stood sh you should still have uBlock or something like that. But that at least gets around it on there. And if you're on Firefox, it's the same thing. Just simply go to your little puzzle piece, go to manage extensions, and you want Tamper Monkey. I already have it installed, but Tamper Monkey. Tamper Monkey. And then you just click install. And then you go to the GitHub and you go to releases. And you click this. And then you click install. And then you can actually undo your little, uh, go to settings. You can undo this as well because that script with Tamper Monkey is already doing it. So get rid of it. It sucks compared to that script. And then uh, let's check out, um, I don't know, Hot Ones. Sick, look at that. And it works with Sponsor Block on top of that. So you know what? Here we are, no ads. Perfect. So if you guys want no ad block detection, Use this dude's script, the real Joe. Joel? The real Joel, sorry. Joel. There's I had a family member named Joe. So I see J-O-E, I just say Joe. But anyway, that's it. That's currently the best way to ad block detection bypass is basically using a tamper monkey script. I don't think there's any other way I can make this video any longer. So I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out. Let's do it again. Because last time this worked so well in the 75k video. Uh, leave me a joke in the comments. And 
maybe what I'll do is I'll make, if this video gets enough views again, which I'm not holding my breath, I never do with YouTube, you never know what's going to happen. If it gets enough jokes in the comments, I'll go through the comments and read the jokes out in a video. And I'm a small YouTuber. I don't care about YouTube ad revenue. So I'll even read the raunchy ones as long as you don't have me saying anything that can get me canceled. Talk to you guys later. Peace out.